Hello ladies and gentlemen, greetings Mac Warriors. this is TTB speaking and welcome back to Mac Warrior Online. Today we are running the Blood Asp in a single gauze and lots of lasers and phasers build. But before we go into that, just a quick public service announcement. Well guys, some of you have already seen it, we have been using the YouTube Premiere feature for the last few videos and it has been amazing so far. What is YouTube Premiere? Well basically, whenever a new video goes live, there uh, is a live chat down below inside the video watch page and that allows all of us together to watch the video at the same time and talk about what's happening, talk about the crazy things that uh, are presented on screen and of course you guys can ask me questions or share your builds with me while we're doing that. So it's basically like a mini live stream where we watch the video together and just have a great time. And by the way guys, make sure you have that little icon selected, the bell that everybody likes uh, to mention always in our videos, that will allow you to see whenever a new video are going live and that way you don't miss it. Alrighty, let's jump right into the action and by action of course I mean the mech lab. Oh yeah. Alright, so we have the Blood Pass B here, we've got one clan gauze rifle, we've got two clutch pulse lasers and we've got five ER mediums, gives us a 71.5 firepower alpha strike at a speed of 65 and a heat management of 1.34. So not too shabby and do take note we do have clan ECM of course in the center torso so this build is also quite sneaky. Well, let's go ahead and take it on the battlefield. Okay guys, so we're here, River City and we are facing the enemy that's coming from Fox 6, Echo 6 and Echo 7. Now the good thing is we do have ECM so we should be kinda protected. Um, I like running ECM max lately because it just keeps you a lot safer and you don't die as fast because apparently people ignore you when you don't have a giant red icon over your head. Okay, so what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to swing to the right a little bit and uh, box the enemies in that are in Fox 6. I just need to be careful that I don't get rushed from the right side if there are any enemies over there. Whoa, okay. So, Moral to see uh, King Crab down below we have... Ooh, <laughs> that's quite a bit of a position. Yeah, okay. Good thing is we have very high weapon mods, we can keep shooting that King Crab here with our Ghost Rifle. Pew! There we go, tight side torso, bye bye! That has to be open. Well, that's descent. a good thing, and now his CT is open as well, so he should be almost one touch if we can hit him. Uh, not quite, I hit the also? leg a little bit more than I hit the CT. Let's try it again. Uh, well, never mind, the crab has found a little house, and by house I mean he's hiding behind a rock. Okay, well, there we go, finally! Exposed himself and he died. That's a Mauler MX90. Six LB2s. Okay. That sounds a little bit dangerous. Let's just walk into that little protected uh, tunnel over here and see if we can find any targets. And looking at the map, we might see some targets once we emerge from down below. Doing a little sneaky attack from down below. Yeah, interesting. That's six LB2s and an AMS. Okay. Well, why not? Model MX90, by the way, guys, also would really good mech if you have one, try to build out, let me know how it works. Okay, so, some targets up on top here, the enemy team is very split, that's very, very good for us. We can go in and try and take out the Molo now, I'm gonna take the left route, because as you could already see on the screen right now, I got a little bit of shot from the right-hand side. Hello, Mr. Mauler, and let's give him a nice volley, there we go, taken out, perfect. Okay, so here's the thing. Now the enemy is slowly Double walking side. towards us, so we can start shifting Double towards six, the left. Six, but I also saw a ping on uh, the radar right down there, so there should be an enemy around here. I just don't know where. Well, doesn't matter. Let's just jump down and uh, dish out somewhere mayhem and hopefully hit those gauze yeah, shots. Push, push, push. TDB, where are you shooting? Come on. Yes, better. Come on. Ah, I missed again. Okay. Fear not. There's more where that came from. Let's keep walking. Let's keep walking. Save the team, provide a little bit of ECM, and try and flank towards the right a little bit. Going on the Stormcrow, and boom! Stormcrow down. Thou hast croaked thy last croak. Enemy crow. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead and go on the Hellfire. Uh, he's pretty damaged right now, side toss is also open, so he should be down uh, from teammate shots momentarily. And we can go ahead and go in on the Bushwhacker. I think he's overheated. Yeah, he was very, very hot, so that's good. We can move in now. As I said, guys, we're just doing around uh, the side here, moving in from the flank, and I'm just trying to hit them from the side now. 
Because uh, if you look at the score right now, we're very, very even. And that's a little bit dangerous. I don't like to be very even with my enemies. I like to destroy them. Hard. Okay. Let's see. Crab, his legs are damaged. That is important to know. Let's see. Can we get a shot in? Ah, uh, not a very good hit, unfortunately. Bushmaker, though. Sightcross is very damaged. And, woo! Hello there, Mortar to see. All right. Um, oh, that's a very damaged Mortar to see. Okay, and <laughs> there's our friend from before again. Uh, can we? Should I? Yeah, just large pulses are enough to see the deal. Let's go in with large pulses and the Gauss Rifle. Just cool down the medium lasers a little bit. Seven kills, two, seven. There's still the crab around here somewhere. And uh, the Morato C. Oh, there's a crab. Okay, we knew that he was weak on the legs. Oh, both, both legs, legs both weak. Legs. Look at that. Tasty, tasty crab legs. Always go for legs on crabs. Let's go ahead and let's mow him down. Perfect. All right. Now we can go in on Hotel and start finishing him. Yep, he's down. Lots and lots of lasers. He couldn't have been shooting that much anymore with one side torso gone. Clan Max in general with their laser boats and they lose a side torso. They get extremely hot. All right. What do we have? There's a Locust running around and there's a Kada as well. Hello, little Locust. Nope. Oh, right hand side. Oh, blimp on the little bit of the um, seismic sensor. Interesting. All right. Shot in the back, guys. Yeah, I really, I really like the seismic sensors. Uh, but I'm, ah, okay, that is what's shooting me in the back. A little locust. Okay, well, yeah, keep running around me. Keep running around me. Be a nuisance. Ah, there he is. Ha ha! Ha ha! <laughs> yeah, well. <laughs> now I just have to twist like an idiot. <laughs> oh, it's, it's open actually. Interesting. Let's turn around again. See if he goes for another pass. Yeah, of course he does. And pew! Ah! I missed the kill shot. I'm so bad. Also so hot. Remember what I told you about the uh, missing side torso? That is exactly what's happening to me right now. So, so hot. Come on, crab man. Take him out. Come on, crab minion. Destroy the enemy locust. Good enemy locust. One touch. Uh, he's running. Okay, well, we can't get him from here. Ah, perfect. 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 Shenanigan 23 ends the locust shenanigans. Perfect. Now we just have to walk into the center. Ah, the crab has already done it. Perfect. GG. Well played. Let's go ahead and have a look at the scoreboard. Five killing blows, six assists, one solo kill, four kill most damage dealt, 694 damage done, and 13 components destroyed. That was a nice round, wow. Lots of carnage and lots of robot limbs ripped away. <laughs> that was a cool round, it's basically um, 11 out of 12 kills between me and the crab. Nicely done, very nicely done. That was beautiful. Alright, let's go ahead and jump into the next game. Yeah, by the way, guys, that happens. I often send friend invites to players that I recognize. Either for playing very well or for being really good teammates. Come on, okay, guys, so, can't be the only as you can see on the phone. map right now and from all the white in your face. No, we're not on a uh, uh, political rally right here. Nope. Unfortunately, we are uh, in the frozen wastelands. Well, actually, Perfect. fortunately, we are in the frozen wastelands. For, who cares about politics? Okay, let's go ahead and push in on out. the supernova. Target Alpha, he's a learn boat and he's out in the open, so he should be easy eatings. Uh, unfortunately, I can't go around this corner right now. There's a reason for that. You remember the uh, countless situations where I walk around corners and be, and be like, I regret my life's decisions? Yeah. That's why I'm not walking and, uh, around this little hill right now. Team? Trust me, the whole enemy team is there. I know it. So let's just go ahead and take some pot shots on whatever we can hit. Um, there was an Atlas there. We still have that Lurm boat over there. Um, Hotel 8, India 8. Our assaults are left behind and they will just die. Uh, if you see your team moving, move with them, guys. Very, very important. Um, if you don't have okay, ECM and you have tonight. good fast, spots to go. hide, like don't maps with buildings and whatnot, push. do not stray away from your team. It is a surefire recipe for death, Fox especially on a map like this one where people just like to crazily NASCAR. Oh. Well, at least we got one kill for our team and now we're going in on that Ultraviolet. 
and luckily I propel myself down the hill a little bit so they can't shoot me. Push, 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 push. Ah, sweet life. I get to enjoy you a little bit more. Let's keep on walking. Let's keep on walking and see what we can do over here. And uh, I'm just commanding the team to start and move towards Hotel 8. Getting uh, into the face of that supernova from before, taking him down because that's going to be a lot of tonnage away from the enemy team. The she blows, alright. There's a UV above left, us, but we can't do anything about that right now. now. What we need to do right now is we need to turn and hey, go into the, the enemy Kill team it. as they're approaching us from India 9. And maybe get them once they are cresting this little hill here. That would be amazing if we can do that. Uh, got a nice hit in on the high level to see. Catapult CT open, that's Catapult also very, very good for us. We should be able to get him. Let's see. Come on, team. Yes, okay. perfect. Alright. Let's keep on moving. Uh, okay. Uh, shoot Dragon. He was a better target because Did the get Hellbringer was walking to behind the cover. So, had I shot him there, I would probably have wasted like two thirds of my lasers. So, I chose the other target. Now we're just moving back to our hill. <laughs> it's getting a little bit claustrophobic here. I uh, missed the shot a little bit. Uh, hit Nova. the leg instead Nova. of the side or so on the Nova. That's okay. Let's go downhill again. Ay ay ay. It's getting a little bit cozy right now. Let's see what do we have Hotel, here. Target, Hotel Direwolf. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. CT. Come on. Yeah. There we go. Hotel's One less Direwolf in this world. And we've got a Light Mech flanking us. Arctic Cheetah CT open. Can we? Nope. That was a miss. Did and I activated my lasers too quickly. And see, guys, there was one bit of a pulse that was missing to kill that guy. But uh, unfortunately, since I shot too early, couldn't get enough damage onto his CT. That's okay, though. So, six kills against seven, very, very close right now. Ah, uh, dude, I think you lost an arm there. <laughs> okay, well, we'll just hold a position here and wait a little bit. Uh, it is getting very cozy in terms of cuddling with mechs, and that's never good. That means no room to maneuver. That was a nice hit onto him. Really nice hit on the cataphract. Unfortunately, the enemy team is now circling from the other side. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we've got the... Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, Heimler's coming in now. Um, there's also Piranha coming for us. I have to push forward now towards Hotel 9 again. And we'll just try and see if we can get any damage down onto anything before we die. Because uh, the enemy team has the problem? advantage right now. And, uh, yep. Uh, yeah, that's painful. Uh, even more guys coming from there, and we're overheating right now, so this means goodbye, side torso. It was nice knowing you. That's okay, we still have half a mech left, and that means we still have all our lasers. And there's a piranha. Looks like we're having fish sticks oh, for I'm dinner. Alright, I'm done. <laughs> Rolling down the hill, doing a nice side flip. Perfect, cartwheel. Alrighty, let's see if we can somehow get the miracle say. Nope. Not gonna happen. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and have a look at the scoreboard. Three killing blows, forces, one solo kill, two kill most damage dealt, 917 damage done, and seven components taken out. Yeah. You know what? That is okay. That is still respectable. Especially since the other guys uh, had two players breaking 1000 damage. Thanks for watching guys, see you at the next premiere, TGB out.